Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Excelism. Today, we have got something really exciting on the agenda. We are delving into the latest updates in the co-pilot for Windows on Bing Chat. These features are not just upgrades, they are the game changers in how we interact with the AI. If you love staying on the top of the latest in technology, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Let me demonstrate these latest changes using both Copilot and Bing Chat. Let me first open the Copilot. This is the Copilot for my Windows. Let me click it. If you are not sure how to install the Copilot for your Windows, I've already made one video that I'm sharing in the description of this video. You probably can watch the same. Let me also open the Edge. I can just go to the Edge. Let me open it. In this, let me search for chart, Bing chart. Once I click it, you'll find your, this is the chart I'm looking for. This is the one you can find here, right? It, it This, whatever you search there in the Bing chart, you can find here. Otherwise, if you want to directly open the Bing chart, just go to the bing.com slash chart. It, it will directly take you to the chart. Earlier in the co-pilot, there was no history. There was no conversation history or chart history. Now, whenever I start having the transaction, today, what is the currency rate of USD by INR? Let me enter. Whatever the conversation it is doing with me in the co-pilot for Windows, it is just searching in the web, trying to get the real-time information. The current exchange rate for USD to INR is one USD is equal to 83.24 INR. It got this information from all these sources. There are five different sources it went and it picked up this information and whatever you are finding when it comes to the currency it is also giving you a user interface where you can directly enter what is usd and what is INR. but here the very important thing which i would like to highlight here earlier there was no chart history now you can find there is a chart history but the same co-pilot either in the windows or in the bing chat we log in using the microsoft account since the account is same the same conversation tomorrow if you are not there if you are not logging into the same desktop maybe you want to browse from the phone then if i want to start doing the same conversation from wherever i stopped then don't worry you just go to the bing chat just refresh this You'll find in the recent history exactly the same. If you can see this was not there earlier, now you can find here. Now I can start doing the same conversation from here. Whatever the answer it has got earlier here, the same answer it is displaying here. So your chart history sync enable you to not only just capable of using in the desktop application of Copilot, you can also use in the browser anywhere even from the phone, you can just open the Bing chat. You can start doing the same conversation by going into the recent activity. Now, let me start doing the conversation here. Can you please provide me last 10 days USD by INR rate in tabular format? Now, it's trying to search in the web, the real-time information. It's going to give you in the tabular format, last 10 days information. Bear with me. It is searching for USD to INR historical data. Sure, here is the last 10 days USD by INR rate in tabular format. Date, USD INR, 14th, today's rate, yesterday's rate, and so on. If, if your network is good, then obviously the results are better faster let it complete excellent it has it it found from five different sources 
this particular information, it has provided properly into the tabular format. Earlier, I used to copy this and I used to open any Excel file and I used to paste it. Even after I paste, I must need to do some formatting adjustments to fit into a proper tabular format. Instead doing this, let me close this file without saving. Instead doing this, in the latest update of Ping Chat, you will find an Excel symbol here. You can directly get this information into the Excel and you can edit there. This saves a lot of time for the users. When they are interacting with the data, which is in the tabular format, again copying, pasting into the Excel, doing the data cleaning, data preparation, takes a lot of time. Instead, I can directly click this button. It is trying to open the Excel web interface of my Microsoft account, and it's going to give exactly the same data with the title, Bing answers, the date, and along with other parameters exactly it copied the same content right this is one great update which, which i like and not only this if at all this conversation you want to download there is an option here export you can export this conversation either in the word format or in the pdf format or in the text format sometimes you may go in depth in having the conversation with either copilot or bing chat where you want to share this entire conversation to your subordinate or maybe to your superior, maybe to your friend. If that is the case, instead, he need to start having this conversation with the same prompts. You can just download this content, maybe using the option called export. Let me start exporting this in the Word document. If I export it, some formatting and images may not appear, that's fine. Yes, it downloaded. Let me click this. The Word document is getting open. Yep, check it out. But because it's a tabular format, it's coming like this. If it is a regular text format, then you'll find it exactly whatever the answer the Bing chat has given you. Even you can download the same in the text format. It's trying to download in the text file. Let me click it. Let me open this file. Yep, you'll find the same answer here, right? So I'm sure this particular functionality of export can save a lot of time for the other person to understand what the conversation we have done. And also, sometimes if we mistakenly erase the history, but some conversation which I have done in the previous may be very important, I want to use for the future, the export could be one of the great options. Other than this, one more great update which I like the most is share option. Once you click this share, you can either share in the Facebook or you can share in the Twitter. That's nothing but the X or you can even share in the email or you can share in the Pinterest. Otherwise, if you want to just share the link, you can just copy this link. The link got copied. Let me open in the private window. Let me paste here so that the other person can see this conversation, right? This conversation, the other person can see. If at all he want to continue, he'll just click the continue. Wherever it got stopped, he can see the entire conversation here because it's a link, right? So these all are different options, which I like the most, which I'm sure you can find it interesting. And let me come back to the co-pilot. I can refresh here. This particular INR, USD by INR exchange rates, the same history now got even updated here. I can just click here, wherever the response stopped, I can start having the conversation. That's what a great sync functionality from Copilot Windows to the Bing Chat. I'm sure these updates in Copilot and Bing Chat are setting a new standard in AI assisted communication. I encourage you to try these out and experience the convenience firsthand. If you found this guide helpful, remember to hit the like button and subscribe for more awesome content. Thank you for watching. Stay curious and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.